If you're a fan of the snow and getting outdoors, it has been a tough winter. Yeah, while ski areas are able to salvage the season by making snow, flat trails for sports like cross country skiing or snowshoeing do not have that option. As New Center Sean Stackhouse reports, that's why some are getting creative. We need at least six inches to start grooming. And right now at Smiling Hill Farm in Westbrook, the trails are bare. We've got some gigantic puddles around here right now. That's it. Typically by this time of year, this family farm will be welcoming more than 100 cross country skiers per day to skate, slide and glide. They've been ready to welcome them since October, but Mother Nature is making it hard. So we start prepping the trails, getting everything ready, transitioning um, the gift shop into the ski center and everything's ready. We just need the snow. 25 miles away in New Gloucester, it's a similar scene, getting teased by Thursday's flurries. Looking out and seeing all the snow coming down, it was it looked really encouraging, but as soon as that rain started, it kind of dashed all our hopes. But poor conditions have meant the team here at Pineland Farms is getting creative. Pretty much conditions right now are ideal for it. Fat tire biking, traditionally a more warm weather centered activity, but with the trails clear of snow, they're seeing an uptick in winter riders. We try to encourage people to stay off the ski trails just because it does dig up the trails, but right now it's fair game. People can go anywhere with them. Back at Smiling Hill, they're working to find new ways to keep families engaged too. Looking at other things to do, especially during February vacation, if we don't have snow. A silver lining here, the warm temps helping bring unseasonably busy business at the farm's ice cream stand. A lot of people are going to come out for ice cream this afternoon. But hoping soon the weather allows less ice cream and more skate skiing. Sean Stackhouse, News Center, Maine.